All right, in this video, I'm gonna show you how to increase your social media likes as well as your stock photography sales. Now, if you're uploading your photos online, there's a lot of different sites to choose from. You can do the social media sites like Facebook, Instagram, and Flickr, the stock photography sites like Alamy and Shutterstock, or the photography-focused sites like Flickr and SmugMug. Now, if you wanna get your photos liked and sold, you're gonna to have to do more than just upload them. You're also gonna to have to go through and add descriptions and hashtags and keywords. And it's slightly different for each site that you upload to. This can take a lot of time. And that's why we developed a website called Photoloo. It streamlines the process, so it makes it much easier for you to get your photos uplined, found, and sold more quickly. Let me show you how it works. So before I start the three minute timer, I've already edited my photo in Lightroom and exported as a JPEG. Now I'm gonna show you how I upload it to all of my social and stock sites. I'm gonna start on the Photoloo login page. Let's start the timer now. So you can sign up for Photoloo for free at photoloo.com, but I'm gonna log in with the user I already have set up. First, I choose the photo I wanna to upload to all the different sites. These are the sites I'm gonna to upload to. All the major social sites like Instagram, Facebook, Twitter, and Flickr, and the stock sites like Shutterstock, Alamy, and Adobe Stock. And my photography website, souvenirpixels.com, which runs on SmugMug. I typically enter the photo title and description in Lightroom, then Photoloo reads it from the metadata. So I can change it here, but this one looks good to me. So I'll just use this for Smug Mug and Flickr, which both allow a title and description. The description I entered in Lightroom wasn't a good stop description, so I'm going to enter a more keyword rich description to be used on the stock sites here. Next, I need to add in my keywords. Now I, I've already added some keywords to the entire shoot in Lightroom, but I want to add some more photo specific keywords. So I'm choosing them from the suggested keywords. Typically I like to have at least 30 keywords per image. That looks pretty good. Now, Facebook has only a post, not a title and description like Flickr, but I'll just put my title on a separate line from my description and post it to Facebook. Now for the tweet. I'm gonna take my photo description and add some additional hashtags to it before I tweet it. Next is Instagram. I'm gonna use the same title and description for Instagram. Then I have a group of hashtags that I've saved as favorites. I'm gonna add those first. Now I'm gonna go in and add some additional suggested hashtags at different levels of popularity. Now I can review what's going to be posted to each site before either posting it now or scheduling it for later. I'll just post it right now. Now, here's where the magic happens. Photoloo is taking that photo and uploading it to all the sites. Now, as the photos are uploaded, the spinning arrows will turn into checkboxes. The green checkboxes indicate that the photo has been posted, and I can click on the checkbox to see the post, and the sites with blue arrows require an additional post step. Most of the stock sites require you to go in and upload releases and set a category before submitting. Since this photo has no releases, this is pretty quick. Alamy is the only stock site that will auto submit for you, but if there are people in the photo, you will still need to go back into Alamy as well and upload the releases for the photo. Instagram has one more step. I already have a photo, the Photoloo app installed on my phone, so I received a notification to finish the post with the app. I need to go through the standard Instagram pages, but when I get to the description section, I can just paste in the description and the hashtags. And that's it. Check the timer. I finish in under three minutes. Now, what do you think? Is that easier or harder than your current workflow? Let me know in the comments. Also, this channel focuses on how you can make money selling your photos online. If that interests you, make sure you go ahead and subscribe. Now, if you want to set up the workflow that I just showed you, you can do so by clicking this link up here, which will take you to a page where you can sign up for Photoloo for free, and then take a look at this video, which will show you how to set up Photoloo. Best of luck selling your photos online.